Geminis, welcome back to my channel. So this is going to be a quick energy check-in reading. We're going to see what your person is feeling and thinking and what you can expect from them. Spirit, what messages do you have for Geminis? What can they expect from their person? What is their person feeling and thinking, Spirit? What can Gemini expect from their person? All right. Home. <laughs> I'm willing to start a fight just to have a chance to talk to you. Just say something to me. I have other priorities that need my attention right now. Please be patient. Please take my call. Let's forget the past and start over. Are you ignoring somebody? I feel like somebody wants you to know that they still love you. This is someone who's about to take action. If this person hasn't reached out to you already, Gemini, expect that they are. Because when I was doing your pre-shuffle, I saw so much communication in your reading but then i also saw maybe you ignoring someone focused on something else or just focused on yourself focus on a job uh, a business maybe ignoring this person or you just not they're not your focus right now and i feel like this person doesn't like that so let's see Spirit, what messages do you have for gemini i was about to say capricorn some of you are dealing with a capricorn all right so we have the three of cups Someone wants your attention. You're going to reunite with somebody. I'm feeling like within the next week or so, if they haven't tried already, could be a cancer. Give me one second. This card just flipped in a circle and then fell on the floor and then rolled underneath the wheels of my chair. <laughs> I'm like, how was I supposed to get that without rolling over the card? All right. Anyway, so it is the King of Wands. <laughs> Okay, so some of you are dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius that wants your attention, Gemini. I feel like this person is used to having your attention, so they feel some type of way because they don't have it right now. So it could be that they did something to you or said something that you didn't like, and you guys are not on the same page right now. Here's the communication. I did see the Eight of Wands a lot in your pre-shuffle. Now, um... Mercury retrograde will be ending soon. We'll be going direct on September 16th. Some of you may hear from a fire sign or a cancer um, or a Capricorn because I was about to say Capricorn when I was pre-shuffling for you earlier. You may hear from one of those signs after Mercury goes direct because that is when communication clears up. People are ready to talk. They're ready to come out of their shell. Now, you may not. Yeah, you got somebody in their feelings. Who is this that y'all have in your feelings, Gemini? <laughs> I mean, who is this that y'all have in their feelings? Not y'all feelings. But who is this that y'all have in their feelings? Because you're not saying anything to this person or they don't know where they stand with you we have anxiety fear despair hopelessness isolation so this person could be isolating themselves because you're isolating yourself from them i'm picking up the energy that some of you may be on um a gemini taurus cusp and your taurus side is kicking in your stubbornness is kicking in yeah there goes the ice cream man again. Like some of y'all feel like this person's immature as hell. <laughs> like the ice cream man is going, it's, it's like, oh my goodness. It's coming around during this reading. All right, let's see. Spare, what messages do you have for Gemini's? What do they need to know? Um, This person has a lot of regret, a lot of sad, definitely wanting to reconcile with you. Definitely have their eye on you. We have the Page of Swords, the Five of Cups, and the Six of Cups. So this person is, there's like a lot of nostalgia, nostalgic energy going on right now with them. They're thinking about what used to be. I feel like someone is thinking that it's over or they're not sure if it's over. They could be looking at pictures look reading old text messages you know what for some of you you sent this person a text message gemini and they didn't respond when you wanted them to and i feel like you were like okay fine cool don't respond because this is it you're not getting another text message from me you're not getting another phone call from me and this person thought that they would and you didn't and now they're like wait let me see what gemini is up to 
they're not talking they're being very secretive they're being you know very silent they got something going on something has their attention so I feel like this person is thinking someone has your attention. Now, for some of you, it could be another person. But for others, I feel like it's just you are focusing on your money, a job, life, something you're doing, or you're just healing. You're, you're just like wanting to be to yourself. We have the moon, the ten of wands, the eight of pentacles, and the five of pentacles. Some of you are working really hard. You may have more than one job that you do. Either you have some financial issues that you're trying to correct or this person does. You're being secretive about the situation or you just maybe, maybe you're like, okay, I need to get my bank account right or I need to get my bills paid and I'm not focusing on anything that's happening that's not that. But because of the moon being here and you're not letting this person know what you're up to, they're worried. They feel a sense of burden. Or this is you. Somebody feels a sense of burden here. I don't know if this is you or your person or if it's both of you. Um, because the moon being here, you guys may be hiding your energy from each other. Some of you are dealing with a Pisces that has some money issues. And they're hiding it from you. I feel like there was a lot of weird energy going on between you and this person doing Venus and Mercury retrograde. Now, Venus just went direct today. So something's going to clear up really soon. You'll notice it. You'll start seeing it within this person. But I feel like because they acted the way they did, they're not going to be able to take your mind off of whatever you're doing because it's like you're moving forward. We have the Four of Swords. Yeah, some of you have money coming in with the Ace of Pentacles, new beginnings with a career, a new job. Or you're manifesting something here. The universe is going to hand you something having to do with money or an opportunity to, to earn more money. And I feel like because this person can't pull you away from whatever your mind is set on, they're thinking about it, though. They're going to rush in here trying to talk to you with the Knight of Swords. Coming out of their pride and their ego, wanting to compromise. Telling you like, you know, I want a solution to the problem we're going through. I want to reconcile with you. I want to fix things. Let's just move on. Let's not keep arguing. So what messages do you have for Gemini? Just give me one more for Gemini for this quick energy check-in reading. Yep. Three of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, the Judgment card. This person's already made up their mind that you are the person that they want to be with. But I feel like you're going to be holding back from this person. And the next card out of the deck is the Page of Cups. And we also have the Nine of Pentacles. Some of you are like, listen, I'm just focused on my money right now. Nothing else matters. We have Scorpio energy here as well. So some of you could be dealing with the Scorpio, but the Page of Cups is here with the Ace of Cups. So there's definitely love coming in for you. You may not even want it though, or you may not be focused on it, or it may just be like your energy has changed, your attitude has changed, and now someone's coming in wanting to make things work with you. Could be a Leo that held back for quite some time. They didn't have the courage and the strength to come towards you and apologize. And make something right after they did you wrong. So those are the messages that I have for your reading, Geminis. Thank you for watching my channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.